All right, legends, welcome back. So in this video, we're just gonna talk about the user interface of the GoPro Studio. The first impression, eye-catching layout of this video editing software. So GoPro Studio is broken up into three different steps. So you've got your step one, your view and trim. This is where we would upload raw videos, find out what we actually wanted to use of those videos, and filter those out from the dead weight. Like for example, you can pull in a 30 second clip, but only want to use one to two seconds of that. That's where we would be performing that task on step one. Step two is really kind of like the Adobe, it's the timeline. It's kind of like Adobe Premiere, Flash, or After Effects. This is where we add all the clips we want to use, add music, add text, as well as effects like slow motion, stuff like that. And then uh, step three, it's really just where you export to your desktop or you could upload it straight to YouTube or something like that. So this is generally just it. Step one, we're just going to pull in, we're going to upload our or import our MP4s into here. We're going to figure out what we want. Step two, we're going to chop it up, make all of our cool stuff look really cool. And then we're going to export it probably to YouTube. So good luck with this. And in the next video, you're going to want to have some footage. So just have whether it's from your GoPro or your DSLR camera or maybe just your iPhone. Pull up some images or some video. I'm sorry, pull up some videos and have them to your desktop. In the next video, we'll go ahead and import those to our step one view and trim. All right, guys, good luck with this. Maybe we'll see you guys in the next video.